What's up y'all? So today we're gonna be going over and reviewing the On Gold Standard Whey Protein and to see if it's even worth your time. There's a couple things you need to look for when you're looking for that right protein. And those things are convenience, mixability, value, taste. Will On Gold Standard live up to these factors? Let's find out. So number one on our list is convenience. Convenience meaning, are you able to purchase this protein easily without having to hunt for it? And fortunately, when it comes to gold standard, you can literally purchase this protein anywhere. And this is important because if a protein is not accessible, it becomes inconvenient. And when something becomes inconvenient, it's not going to happen. Amazon has it, Costco, GNC, and tons more vitamin shops. And I'll be leaving a link for you below in the description on where you can get this protein. Kind of check it out and research it yourself. Number two, mixability. So when it comes to mixability, I think that's like one of the crucial factors in finding that right protein because the last thing you want to do is drink a chunk or a ball of protein that hasn't been mixed and it's just a really bad time. I remember buying this cheap protein back in the day. Oh, I forget what it's called but I, I shook it as much as I could and when it came to drinking it, I actually chomped down a huge ball of protein. It was probably the nastiest thing I've ever experienced, ever. I mean, think of like something super soft and then chalky. Gold standard on the other hand, mixes pretty damn well and it mixes well to a point where you really don't have to shake it that much and if you do shake it a lot just know it's gonna be mixed it mixes well with minimal effort and that's what we need that's what we need we can't finish off an intense workout with chunky protein number three is going to be value so when it comes to protein i want to get the best bang for the buck and you know i don't want to pay a premium for like a really small amount of protein it just doesn't make sense to me because if you're working out as much as you should be doing like you know every day or every other day then that protein's gonna run out really quick and you know it, it's a pain when you have to keep going to the store or you know or having to order it again so to prevent that I like to look for the best value and when it comes to gold standard they do a great job in regards to packing a ton of protein at a really affordable price as you can see from the one I have it has 80 servings in a 5.46 pound bag now this is a huge bag and it requires a zip opening rather than one of those screw tops you know what i'm saying where i got this specific variation of the protein from costco and they i got it at a really good deal at 29.99 it was on sale so if you have a costco near you go ahead and go to costco and you'll you may find this on sale if you can find this at costco you're probably going to get the best bang for the buck just because you know they they price it down really cheap and they have sales all year round and if you can find it on sale you're going to get it for like lower than 30 bucks which is amazing for five pounds of jam-packed protein if you can't find it at costco amazon is probably the next easiest thing to get it from just because you could just place on order or you could do like a subscribe option where you know they send it automatically just know that costco has the best value So when it comes to taste, I believe Gold Standard has a unique one. And if you were to blindfold me and uh, had me drink 10 different proteins, I would know which one Gold Standard is. That's how unique it is. And it's not a bad thing. I actually love the flavors of Gold Standard. I haven't come across a flavor that I didn't like. And speaking of flavors, they have a bunch of flavors that targets everyone's taste buds. So they got flavors like Double Rich Chocolate, French Vanilla Cream, Mocha Cappuccino, Cookies and Cream, delicious strawberry and it says delicious strawberry not just because it's delicious banana and cream they have extreme chocolate extreme milk chocolate sorry chocolate supreme i don't know what the hell the difference is probably a little bit more chocolatey it's it's cool to try them all i like to get the vanilla flavor just so i can mix it in my smoothies it's a neutral base so you're not going to get a clash of flavors if you get like mocha cappuccino and you know mix it with strawberries right like it, it, it's just gonna be weird if you get the vanilla which is the one Costco has Costco actually sells vanilla and chocolate I use the vanilla flavor for my shred bowl if you guys haven't watched the shred bowl video you can click the link below in my description honestly if I were to rate this protein in regards to taste out of a scale of 
1 through 10, I would give it a 9. Lastly, do I recommend this protein? Hell yes, I recommend this protein.